boat friends. That's one heck of a way to start out a video. 8.25 p.m. Central Time here in Duluth, Minnesota. We have the Viking Polaris going outbound. First time that I've ever seen this vessel in person. I'm excited to check it out. I was originally on the North Pier, and I flipped over to the South Pier because I saw the sky conditions. Take a look in the background. You can see kind of the fog, the overlay with the clouds. 59 degrees, 11 mile per hour wind out of the north, as you can see with the flag. But take a look over into Canal Park. See all that fog? This is hanging down. But I definitely have plenty of information to share with you about this vessel. Well, let's get started. 665 feet in length, the Viking Polaris. There are 378 guests on board, crew 256. It's a polar class vessel, so this actually sails to the Arctic. Year was built, 2021, and it was built in Norway. Owner is Viking Cruises, sister ship, as you've probably seen before, the Viking Octantis. Max speed, 18 knots, and it really looks good. And again, you can see some of that sky in the background. The guests are all along their windows there. But here's something else that I wanted to share with you, too, before we get into marine traffic. This is the Great Lakes collection from Viking Expeditions. So to go on this boat, you're talking about 12,000 American. It's a 15-day cruise. It goes from Toronto to Duluth. But in this case, it was a turnaround day, so all of the crew helped new passengers get on board. But it goes from Toronto, you go to Canada... Detroit, you can see all these different locations these passengers get to check out. And uh, the last one is Duluth, but now they're going to do the reverse order. The next stop for this vessel is going to be Thunder Bay, Canada. Take a quick peek at marine traffic before we really start looking at the vessel. Viking Polaris, 5.3 knots, as I mentioned, going to Thunder Bay, Canada. Now let's check this vessel out. Wanted to have that sky in the background for you. I always try to give you a few things to look at. Great looking modern vessel. Take a look at the flying bridge. Modern new communication equipment. And you can see the, the passengers that are departing on their uh, journey for 15 days, which they will end up in. Toronto, Canada. Fun way for them to start out going under the area lift bridge. Great looking vessel. See if we can get some of these passengers. I'm sure they're excited starting their journey. I think all of us would be. Look at the passengers waving having fun well, let's also check out this wonderful looking vessel you got people waving out of the window right here look at all the people in the windows i don't want to get too close i see people in bathrobes there so let's just pull it back this is a pg show just take a look at this though Absolutely fantastic. This is what shuttles these passengers from shore to the vessel. And this was pointed out by one of the boat friends before, that big dome there, that satellite communication. But just moving really smooth through the canal. Got someone up in that window up there. Everybody's looking out of their window. They're having a fun time. Very impressive vessel. Well, both friends, that's a brand new one for me. And it was worth 
the way to check it out, take a look at these skies here in Duluth. Well, I'll be out here with the next vessel. Boat friends, I always appreciate you watching. And you never know what vessel's around the corner here for us. But uh, if you're interested in additional videos, here's a few to choose from.